weekend. Right now in Tuscaloosa, we're starting to see some signs of that sunshine, and this is a clue as to what will happen overnight tonight. The clouds that we see here will begin thinning out from central and into east Alabama overnight tonight. Right now, it's already started to our west. Temperatures in west Alabama a bit warmer in the lower 80s right now. We do have some rain to track. I want to bring that up for you right now. Anywhere from uh, Wadawi down towards Roanoke into uh, Lafayette there, and then we've got some lighter showers towards Clanton, and that's going to shift south of Jemison along Highway 31 and 65, and then moving its way eastbound. But most of the rain is starting to fizzle even as we speak. Heaviest rainfall will stay aligned south of I-20 for the most part. We do have a few showers just north of Heflin there, moving towards Rome, Georgia. So overnight tonight, not a whole lot of wet weather. It's a good night to enjoy this evening with winds out of the north. That will bring in some of that drier air, so not so steamy outside. Temperatures will hold in the 80s through your 5 o'clock hour. At 7 o'clock, a pair of 7s. How fitting. 9 o'clock at 70 degrees, and then we're on our way into the lower 60s shortly after midnight. 68 at 11, just to put that in perspective, was our morning low this morning. So temperatures will drop another 5 or so degrees overnight tonight. Cold front that moved through has turned into a stationary boundary, and that's where most of this activity is right now. You can see on our expanded radar view a lot of lightning and thunderstorms right along that front. But at this ridge of high pressure sitting back to our northwest, that's what's going to move in, and that will dominate our weather over the next several days. One thing to note over the next 48 hours, these lower dew point values, that keeps us dry. That's nice in June, but those dew points will be going up next week, so we'll get back more into that sticky and humid category. For tonight, upper 50s, low 60s, not bad. 59 in Jasper, 63 in Birmingham, 60 from Asheville to Gadsden. Through the day tomorrow, temperatures in the mid-70s by mid-morning, lower to mid-80s for your lunch hour with those highs tomorrow afternoon in the mid to upper 80s. Some places like Tuscaloosa and Moundville flirting with 90 degrees, mid-80s from Coleman to 86 in Gadsden. If you're heading to the Stallions game, it will be at Legion Field as uh, Protect the Stadium will be getting ready for the Garth Brooks concert. 84 for that 2 o'clock kickoff, 73 for that final whistle and the Garth Brooks concert, sunny and bright, and we are going to see those temperatures at the set in the 70s for the start of that concert. Still have potential tropical cyclone one that will impact southern Florida. No threat to Alabama. It just gets hot next week. Temperatures will be back.